So the, the key is that in the end, if you're not having sex on a regular basis, um, there is obviously issues with either desire or control and other types of manipulation and other types of issues. So there's obviously issues with desire or emotional injuries. Now, our desire may be injured in sex. So for example, if to give you an example, if your desire is injured, what that means is that you might have issues of shame about having a sexual desire, right? And this is often imposed upon us as we're children. Like, so that what, what often happens is if we experience a desire for sex, we become, if it's a male, we become erect. And then our mother noticed us like that and then felt disgust, disgust at, that, at, at us doing that when we were only five or six years of age. We felt her disgust and then felt we had to shut that down. So, so can you see how then my desire for sex is shut down as well? So, so that could have happened. Right, in the sense of desire for sex being shut down, or it can be an emotional injury about vulnerability being open. The key is to allow yourself to explore it emotionally every single time. To give you an example for myself, like, um, I, oh, I just leave it, just skip me too. That's very rare. <laughs> and I must have to say it at this point. But um, I, I was thinking about my relationship with Mary and how at times, Oh, that's what it was. Uh, what happens with myself and Mary? I'm so used to giving to a woman sexually. And so I'm so used to being the person who, who does a lot of the work, if you like, in, in, the, in the act, and I enjoy that a, a lot. However, when Mary chooses to do that with me, I get very confronted. Because it feels like I'm not worthy of her attention, I'm not worthy of her sexual attention, and so forth. And I've had some quite large issues to work through regarding that feeling, feeling when she becomes um, the person, I suppose you could say, who's, the, who's giving and she wants me to receive, I'm finding it very, very difficult to receive. So you'll find generally with sex, you'll either have, you will, there'll be one of three different types of injuries. There'll be, if you have injuries with giving, you have injuries with receiving, or both of those particular things. And the key is to allow yourself to work through those in an emotional way. So in your case, you have injuries with giving, and that's to do with some anger issues with your mother. You have injuries with receiving, and that's to do with some feelings and viewpoints you have about yourself as a man. And if you allow yourself to work through both those sides of injuries, you'll find in the end you will have a sexual desire that's constant every single day, and, and obviously can be fulfilled as well if, if your partner is also in the same state.